Some neighbors in Spring Valley decided today they couldn't wait any longer for someone to come and clear out their storm drains ahead of the rain tomorrow. So what they did is climb over these fences and clean out the drains themselves. Using tools of their own, Homeowners on Broadview Street in Spring Valley decided they were not going to wait any longer for someone to come and clean the storm drains behind their houses. We can't keep sitting on our hands and wait for the rain to come to lose even more. One of those drains is directly behind Alicia Crow's house. She says she's repeatedly asked Caltrans to clear the backup. On Tuesday, she says crews came out and cleaned the area on top of the grates. I can't speak highly enough of these gentlemen that came out. But she says it was still clogged inside the drain. So with more rain just hours away, neighbors teamed up and got to work using shovels, rakes and ladders to access the area. Within a few hours, they'd removed multiple trash bags full of debris. Maybe three feet of dirt and pine needles and just, I guess, regular debris. Most, if not all of these families lost everything during last week's storm, their homes flooding with several feet of water. They say they wanted to make sure that didn't happen again. I don't think we're getting help ever, so yeah, we just had to do it ourselves. Um, we already lost everything, so I don't want to go through that again. I reached out to Caltrans, who in a statement told me they've been working to respond to storm damage, saying they understand the residents' concerns, but advising against opening any drains, saying doing so could result in injuries or damage to the drains. Caltrans says they will be monitoring drains, including these two, during the storm. But homeowners on Broadview say they couldn't afford to wait. Instead of getting up to here with water, if we flood, maybe it's only going to go to our ankles. Oh, I feel like everyone has more of a peace of mind. You know, we're not just sitting there hoping it doesn't flood. Now we're here preventing. In Spring Valley, we are Broadview strong, and that's, that's the only thing I can say. Laura Acevedo, ABC 10 News.